So, here we are in the Whitechapel AM studio. Now, we're going to be teaching you how to set the levels for any source. So that could be your microphone, that could be a CD, that could be a jingle. The process is exactly the same. So the very first thing we need to do is to make sure that our channel is armed. In other words, the on button is switched on. So for this example, we're going to use CD1. So the next thing we need to do is then press the Q or the PFL button. Now we need to press play from our source, in this case, CD1. When setting your levels for your songs, you want to fast forward to the loudest part of the song and then set your level from there. The next thing we need to do is to adjust the levels. For music, the needle should be bouncing between four and five. As you can see in this example, the levels are too loud. So we need to adjust the gain or the trim button so that the needles bounce between four and five. This is the correct level for music. When you set the levels, switch off the PFL button. Now you're ready to open the fader to the correct part of the desk. We're opening the fader to the top where it says zero. And when you look at the meters, they will now be bouncing between four and five. Setting the levels for the microphone is exactly the same process. So, first of all, make sure it's switched on. Next, press the PFL button. Speak into the microphone and adjust the levels using the gain or the trim button. When setting the level for your voice, you want the meters to bounce between five and six. When you're happy with your vocal levels, switch off the PFL button. Open the fader to the correct part of the desk. In our case, we're going to the top where it says zero. The meters should now be reading between five and six. The process for setting your guest's level is exactly the same. Make sure it's switched on. Press the Q button, make your guest speak into the microphone, adjust the level until they're bouncing between five and six on the meters, switch off the PFL button, open the fader to the top of the desk. 